guys, welcome to Big Smart Reviews. Today we're gonna review an amazing game for the 3DS. It's an eShop game. So there we go. We don't do that very often, do we? It's called Pull Blocks. And guess what you do in this game? Exactly, you pull a lot of blocks. In fact, this game is so cool. I'm gonna have to continue this whole review with my cool glasses on. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, oh yeah. There we go, now we look all cool for a cool game, and let's do this with you. Okay, so let's have a look at the basic beauty of pool blocks. So here, this is a this is a pool block puzzle, and I need to get up here. Now you see the whole puzzle goes three squares in, which means I can pull the puzzle out three times. One, two, and three. I don't have to do it three times, I can just pull it out two times. But basically, I need to get up to the top right here. This was a very simple one. Let's look at a bit of a more complicated one. Okay, now this time it's a bit more complicated. Here at the bottom, we can see the entire puzzle. So here, this is me. Oops. Continue. That's me right there. I have to get to the top. And you see how many pieces we have now? A lot more. And I like the music as well. Look at that. It's so relaxing, isn't it? So here we go. Let's start pulling these out. I always recommend to pull out one of them all the way out. Okay, let's pull this one. Basically, we, we want to climb up to the top. There we go. We got a flag out. And basically, we're making steps for ourselves. There we go, look at that beauty, huh? What is it about blocks that makes them so damn cool? Look at this block. Hey, my phone is going off. Let's see who it is, right? Let's see. Should we all see who it is together? Should we see who it is together? Okay, let's let's check this out. Let's check this out. Oh, okay, it's my housemate. Okay, I thought, I thought it was a girl or something. It's my housemate. Fuck it. The other very awesome thing, and this is a very, very awesome thing, I'm very impressed with this, is that you can build your own puzzles, and then you can share the QR codes online so other people can download your puzzles, copy them, and uh, play around with them. They can also add their own little pieces to them so they can send it back to you. you then you can check it out if it's cool enough or if it's any better, you know, you can add your own little piece, and like that, you guys can just like play around and creating puzzles which is I think is really really amazing here I'm gonna make my own very quick little pool blocks puzzle you see it's dead simple you just create these blocks how you want them to be by clicking on these different colors uh, you can even change the colors if you change your mind let's have some orange here and let's have some light blue here and how about some green that colors do go more in depth right here you see that you can also delete stuff if you don't like it. It's basically like using Microsoft Paint. Very, very simple. And here at the top, you can see a whole puzzle. Okay, so let's quickly just uh, draw something. Let's use some nice colors here. There we go. Okay, let's test it out. Here we go. This is the puzzle that I made myself. Let's check it out, huh? What do you think of it? Okay, not the most creative puzzle, I know, I know. Let's start though, let's uh, pull this out. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's see, how do we get to the top? I don't know if I can actually do my very own puzzle, but um, it's good to experiment, right? It's very good to experiment. Okay, I think if I pull this one out now. It's nice to be surprised uh, with your own work, you know, just... Oh, I see I made that a bit way too high. I can't, actually can't get up there now. Let me just erase this little part right here. There we go. And now we go back to test. Well, I completed my puzzle and I want to show you uh, in Rewind how I completed it. Check it out. It actually turned out, once again, better than I thought. You know, I was pleasantly surprised because it turned out to be a, bit, a few more pieces than I thought. And there we go. That's my puzzle right there. That's pretty much what I did. You see, you can... Did a bit of thinking, did a bit of climbing, jumping here and there, and there we go. And now after you finish your own puzzle, you can create a QR code for it. So here we go, this is my QR code, and I'm going to enable people to play around with my puzzle so they can change it around if they want, and that is a QR code of my puzzle. And you can save this on your SD card, like so. And then you can just post it on your Facebook page if you want. You can snap a picture and put it on your Twitter, Facebook, you know, wherever you want. You can print it out, give people at school. And with your 3DS, you just snap a picture of that and it's gonna recreate that puzzle on your, in your game. You blocks are so hot. Oh, nah. Let me know if you do have this game and if you do decide to recreate my puzzle, I would love to see what you do with it. So, 
I think uh, I think you got the general idea of how this thing works, and I think it's very very cool, a very creative game, and I find it pretty addictive. And again, I find it just so amazing how awesome and how addictive a, a, a game can be just with simple blocks. You can push blocks sideways as well. Look at that. Oh, here, this is what we do. There we go. There we go. Look at that. You know, it makes you think, it's cute, it's addictive, it's exactly what you want from an awesome game where you just spend like 10 minutes on, on, this is a great game to play on your commute to work or to school, look at that, fantastic, just fantastic, and look how many, look how many levels there are, right? I'm pretty sure you, this is gonna last you a long, long time, look at how cute all these little chubby dudes are. <laughs> there we go, that was my review for Pool Box for the 3DS. Tell me if you got this game, I gotta tell you, it is a fantastic game, dead simple, dead fantastic, exactly how we like it, don't we? Okay, that was my review. Tell me whatever you want in the comments, by the way, bye!